you guys are looking for legit monitored accounts, money drops, cash drops, services, anything, head over to digizani.com. Use discount code DINAROBSHD for 5% off all purchases. Be sure to check them out, guys. Yo, what is up gamers, it's your boy Dino, welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. In today's video guys, I've got something a little bit different for you again, it's the Beth modded outfit tutorial, which will allow you to make the outfit in the thumbnail, okay? So with this one, you'll also need requirements of two consoles, you'll also need netcut, which is linked in the description, and there's also a website in the description, you can go ahead and check out where the components are, okay? So I'll leave that in there as well. Now if you're making the same outfit as me, um, you go ahead and go to a clothing store, okay? So before I do continue with it, I'd just like to say, uh, throughout this glitch at some point I do forget to show you the merging Gorga pants um, how to do it but I'll explain to you how to do it at the same time okay if you're already familiar with this glitch you should already know how to do it but anyway go to a clothing store buy this guffer top right here uh, go ahead then and go ahead and take off a all accessories such as gloves hats earpieces glasses stuff like that so for me I'm taking off my gloves and my earpiece and my, my hat and stuff and uh, once you go ahead and done that go back into the top section go to the designer t-shirts and you want to go ahead and put on check a little designer t-shirt okay which allows us to merge from console to console so be this one right here all right so once you go ahead and got that on all you want to go ahead now is sort your pants out so you're going to go ahead and go to the pants section go to shorts and you want to go ahead and put on the red leather heart boxes shorts okay that will allow us to merge from console to console Once you've got your love heart boxes on, you're completely fine to go. You can then go ahead and save this as console number one outfit, okay? Now, you will also need to have a parachute at some point of this glitch. Um, you'll need to have the Israel parachute and the classic parachute, okay? So this is my console one outfit. I'm going to go ahead and make my console two outfit, which is going to the um, stand itself. Go into racing um, jackets and stuff like this. And then go ahead and select the white one. From there, you want to go ahead and save this in console number two. For your third and final outfit, you'll need to make a merge outfit, which will be your smart jacket outfit, okay? Uh, you'll also need a gorga pants, like I said here, I didn't show you this part at the, end, at the beginning, so I'm going to save this here, okay, use gorga pants. But I will show you how to merge everything all together, uh, apart from the pants itself, which I completely forgot to record actually, but I'll tell you what to do, okay? So for your second uh, merge outfit, all you want to go ahead and do is purchase this outfit right here, which is the sports... Um, the smart jacket and navy jacket at the very bottom and then you want to go ahead and keep this as as merge okay so i'm going to name mine as merge so you should have this as merge your first console and your second console okay and then obviously your gorga pants in your slot number one all right so if you're not familiar with the beth glitch itself i will leave a link to a bulletproof helmets glitch which will show you how to go ahead and do uh, console to console okay so um for console to console you want to go ahead and select your console number one put a parachute on which i'll show you what to do here is put a parachute israel's parachute bag on uh, then when you go into your second console you want to change to your second character or second outfit which would be console number two and then once you've got the auto save on console number two go back to your console number one and take off the parachute all right so let's get into this glitch put a parachute on let's get it done all right and so once you've gone ahead and done the glitch this is what you should actually end up with console to console then from there all you want to go ahead and do is click start go to online jobs rockstar created and go to um versus crooked cop once you're tied crooked cop make sure it's set to player owned and all you want to go ahead and do is merge this together okay so from there go ahead and put it to player owned when you're in there go once to the left and then once to the right and this is what you should be outcomed with all you want to go ahead and do is ready up then put a rebreather on and quit the mission when you quit the mission go back to a online session you then go ahead and save this as an outfit as to console to keep make sure you save it as something else you don't replace the save or you'll mess up the glitch so make sure you save this as something else for me i'm going to call mine console 2. all right so i've called mine console 2 keep now all we got to do from here is merge our outfits together again with the beth glitch okay so this time though you want to go ahead and put on a t-shirt saying merge which would be in our top section so we've got a t-shirt and you're going to go ahead and put on a standard green t-shirt which would be this one here at the very very bottom okay so here it is the green one go ahead and put this on you want to go ahead and now save this as your merge slot so you're going to go ahead and replace the slave at the very bottom say merge 
once you go ahead and done that you want to go ahead and put the outfit you want to go ahead and put the stickers on okay so with console number one you want to change it around okay so obviously go to your racing suits with on the stickers that you want on go ahead and select it so you've got the blue one you got the black one the white one so forth and so on the ones that doesn't work at the very very top is the only racing suit that doesn't work so for me for this tutorial i'm going to use the gray ones because i like the stickers of it and we had, and then go ahead and literally save this on my console number one with that being said then you can then go ahead and do the glitch itself by always putting your parachute on first on your console number one once you've got your parachute on go to your net curve disconnect go to console number two which would be console number two keep by the way guys go to keep not console number two once you're on console number two keep go ahead and go get your auto save go back to console number one and take your parachute off all right so let's do the glitch then let's go ahead and put a parachute on let's do the beth glitch all right once you've done the glitch this is what you should be outcomed with just like this you've got the two um side piece shoulder blades uh, once you've got that you want to spawn then to a quicker cop session again so once you're back on your console one go start online rockstar created versus and go to quicker cop now you want to go ahead and merge it together so make sure it's set to player owned go one to the left when you're in a mission and one to the right and this should be outcome so pretty straightforward go ahead and ready up go into the mission put a rebreather or an earpiece on and then quit the mission and then you should go into an online session with this outfit all right so obviously we've got our outfit now all you want to go ahead and do is save this in console number one once you've saved it in console number one, you're sorted to go with this, okay? So all you want to go ahead and do from here, if you want to go ahead and take off the shoulder blades, which I am doing for this outfit itself, uh, all you want to go ahead and do is put on this uh, ash um, checker plate right here, the, the desert one. All right, so once you go ahead and put that on, you then go ahead and go to the shoe section, and you want to go ahead and take off your shoes for your console number one. So go to go ahead and boots, go no shoes, and save this as console number one outfit. With console number two outfit, all you want to go ahead and do is go to the shoe section and all you want to go ahead and do is literally put on some skate shoes just like you see here. Alright, so console number two obviously and number one are sorted and uh, yeah, you're sorted to go. So console number two will be these shoes here, resave that over console number two. Now from here your merge, which will be depending on what you want to use, you can use the uh, racing suit or you can use deadline. For me I'm using white deadline. So you had to go to deadline section and you want to go ahead and put the weight deadline and save this as your merge slot okay now remember i said before you need a classic parachute bag for this glitch all you want to go ahead and do now is go ahead and select your console number one outfit and once you do go ahead and select your console one outfit you want to go ahead and put the classic uh, parachute bag on this time okay make sure it's not the israel one the classic one otherwise the glitch will not work for you once you've got your all saved do the best glitch Oh, once you've done your Beth glitch, what you should do, you should spawn back onto your console one after you've done that with a no shoes on, okay? So if you spawn with shoes on when you've done the glitch on your console number one, you need to do it again. You should spawn in without any shoes. With that being said, then go ahead and host up a crooked cop and go ahead and set it to play owned. Once you're in there, go ahead and go one to the left and one to the right and your Tron shoes then should merge over to your whole outfit. Once you've done the glitch, uh, do a rebreather, save it and stuff like that should spawn in an online session with the Tron shoes itself. All you want to go ahead and do there is take all the accessories off, just re the and save this in your slot number one. Okay, so console number one is now with Tron shoes and your console number two should be looking like this. So to make this outfit, all you want to go ahead and do is go to the jeans section and go ahead and put on these war jeans right here. And then go up to the boots section and go ahead and put on the same boots I do use here, which is the rubberized boots, okay, for your console number two. So rubberized boots, I want to scroll through here until I come across the outfit, uh, the shoes I actually am owning right now or using right now, so I don't flip the colour of my actual Tron shoes themselves. So here they are, you want to go ahead and put these on right here, and then you want to add save this as your console number two outfit. Alright, pretty straightforward and pretty easy, this is where you go ahead and then do the console glitch, and then go ahead and merge your Gorga pants, okay? So this is what I said before, I completely forgot to, uh, to put this uh, in the video, um, but uh, it's the same as last time, you do your Beth glitch by putting your parachute onto your 
um, you know, your console one and stuff like that. All right, before doing that though, make sure you go ahead and save your gloves that you want to use in your merge slot, which is slot 20 or slot 15, wherever your last slot is, and obviously your Gorga pants in slot one. So I'm gonna tell you what to do now with the glitch itself. Like I said, I missed out the Gorga pants section part. Uh, all you wanna go ahead and do is select your console number one outfit, which would be this one right here. Go ahead and put a parachute on, do the Beth glitch, uh, come back on, you should spawn exactly the same uh, as you should with your pants on. With that being said, go to Crooked Cop, go and merge them and go once to the right this time, which would be your slot one number one, Gorka Pants, and then back to the left and quit the mission. And this is what you should look like. Alright, so then all you want to go ahead and do is merge your gloves over. Once you go ahead and done that, go to Start, Crooked Cop, and pretty straightforward, go one to the left this time instead of one to the right to merge your um, actual pants over. So this is what you should have look like right then. Go ahead and put a reboot on in the mission or an earpiece and quit the mission. Once you quit the mission, you should then spawn online like this. All you want to go ahead and do is save this as an outfit by taking off all your um, accessories. Save it as console number one and you're sure to go okay. Now console number two uh, is, um, this is where it comes a bit tricky and a bit, bit difficult okay. So all you want to go ahead and do now is go to the mask stand, or sorry, mask stand, sorry the um, accessory stand and go ahead and put on a mask with the gas mask on okay because we need to do this now to merge our bell over to our outfit that we are using <clears throat> all right so i'm going to put the black one on all you want to go ahead and do here is save this in slot number 20 if it's like all your last slot as gas or anything like that something that you know that it is use that one all right once you've got your gas mask on all you want to go ahead and do is head to a, a telescope, do the telescope glitch by running past it, double clicking right on your d-pad to get glitched out. This will take your mask off, then all you want to go ahead and do is select your console number one outfit. Once you select your console one outfit, when you walk away from the telescope, the glitch mask will glitch onto your outfit. All you want to go ahead and do is go to any clothing store or a mask store and save this as your console number one merge, okay? So, be very, very, very bottom, merge which we did have our gas mask section in, so what mine was slot 20, you want to have to save this over as merge, okay? Now, all you want to go ahead and do from here is once you've saved it, is go ahead and take the easy way out once you go ahead and sort of that, okay? So what you'll need next, next is for the actual outfit itself is the paramedic belt or a some sort of cop belt or whatever you want to use in your slot number 19, okay? So you've got your merge, Above that, you've got your outfit with the actual uh, gun belt or cock belt, whatever you want to use. And uh, later on, you'll need a CEO vest, okay? So we'll get into that bit later. So for now, you've got your merge and you've got your uh, outfit with the belt on, okay? Which is this one here. So once you've got them sorted out, you've got your belt and you've got your merge sorted, all you want to go ahead and do is head over to a crooked car, oh, sorry, crooked car, sorry, a, a invite only session, and then go to a tighten up a job. So ahead and select your merge outfit first, go ahead and take your easy way out. Once you've taken the easy way out, go start online missions, tie another job. Alright, once you're in Titan of a job, all you want to go ahead and do is go over to an animation store and save this as your merge, okay? Or slot one, sorry, or merge. I mean. Once you've over saved your merge, you will not be able to select your outfit, so go to interaction menu, select another outfit. And if you can't select your merge outfit, that means the glitches work for you, okay? So all you want to go ahead and do from here is quit the mission. Uh, when you quit the mission, you want to go ahead and host up a uh, Crooked Cop mission one more time. So I've quit the mission. I spawn into the online, I will not be able to save my outfit, so then go to start, online, jobs, rockstar created, and go to crooked cop. Once you're in crooked cop, you can then go ahead and merge your um, belt itself, so go two to the left, and then back to the right, and then you can go ahead and put your belt on to your outfit. Go ahead and go into the mission, put a reboot there, or an earpiece on, and then quit the mission. Once you quit the mission, you're in your online session, save this to console number one outfit again, and then you're moving on to the last part, Rishi. So all you want to go ahead and do now is literally put on a CEO vest in slot number 20, which would be your merge, which is like here, you see. 
and then obviously your new outfits should be called console 101 and console 22. So for me, I've got two new outfits. I've got the casino hoodie and obviously the outfit with the red uh, bigness pepper. And for that, I've got a standard black t-shirt and obviously your merging vest. What you want to go ahead and do now is do this, the actual glitch itself by going to console number one, put the parachute on, go to console two, go ahead and take the parachute off back on console number one. All right, so let's do the death glitch and this should be your actual outcome. Once you've done the Beth glitch, this should be your outcome. You should have a little a little black plate underneath your actual hoodie. From here, you will need to host up a Kroger Cop again. Or get an invite from your friend. Once you're entire Kroger Cop, we're going to go ahead and do is go on to the left and one to the right to merge your CEO armor. And then that is done for you there, okay? Pretty straightforward, go into the mission, put a rebreather and an, or an earpiece on, and then go ahead and quit the mission. When you quit the mission, go back into an online session and then go ahead and save this as your merge at the very, very bottom, okay? So we've got our hoodie and our CEO vest merged together. That is now our new complete merge. All we've got to do now is do the Beth glitch just one more time if you go ahead and do that, okay? So all you're going to go ahead and do is select your console number one outfit and then you want to go ahead and do it with your console number two, okay? so. Obviously with our console number two now, we've got our console number one with the vest on and our console number two, okay? So these pants are found in the casino by the way, so you'll need to have to get them, okay? Otherwise your pants will be changing colour while doing the glitch. Now to do a Beth glitch again, all you want to go ahead and do is select console one, put your Israel parachute on, go to console two with the net cut done, go ahead and get the auto save, go back to console one, put the parachute on. Once you go ahead and done that, this is what your outfit should actually go ahead and look like. Um, once you go ahead and done Beth glitch, obviously. From here, all you want to go ahead and go to Kroger Cop Mission. Go ahead and go one to the left to merge it, and then one to the right, and your whole outfit then should combine together. With that being said, go into the mission, put a rebreather or an earpiece on, and then quit the mission. And that is the full outfit tutorial Beth glitch for you guys. Uh, again, if you guys do not know how to do the Beth glitch, it is linked in the description for my... Um, colored helmets glitch is how to do it okay so pretty straightforward guys i hope you enjoyed today's video if you did please do go ahead and drop a like on it subscribe to the channel if you are new and definitely be sure to hit that bell icon next to subscribe to never miss out a future video i do go ahead and post if you guys enjoyed the outfit let me know in the comment section what you think if you guys have any questions head over to my discord twitter and stuff like that is all linked below until next time guys it's your boy dino thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the very very next one peace out homies